Welcome back to Photography by Harrison. And what we're going to be doing today, we're going to take the FC 300 and the FC 1002 and do a strictly auto test. We're going to try auto exposure and auto focusing. We're going to put them side by side and see how the two cameras compare. With that being said, I'll see you on, on the other side of this audio test. And since they are Panasonic's, hopefully these stand up from the in focus. If you're not, I'm going to show them, I'm going to show them to you exactly the way the camera had photographed them. So again, with that being said, I'll see you on the other side of this auto exposure, auto uh, focus test. I forgot to mention at the beginning of the video, it's actually what Panasonic calls their intelligent auto. You know, since the auto exposure, you know, the focusing, and of course even the ISO. So I'm going to let you decide which camera you think did the best from scene to scene. Did one camera do better in one scene as compared to another? Or was it consistent, consistently one camera over the other? And the FC-1002 will be on the left, and the FC-300 will be on the right. So. Leave your comments below, and of course, while you're down there, hit the subscribe button, also hit the notification button so you can get all my videos. And also, like I say, when you do leave a comment, tell me why you like it, because that motivates me to go out and do more videos. If you don't like it, that's fine. Just tell me why you don't like it, because guess what? That also motivate me to go out and do more videos, because you know, I say it all the time, when it comes to photography, no one knows it all. And you know, the more you learn about photography, the more you learn you didn't know. And by the way, this is just part one of this auto focus test correction. Intelligent auto, auto focus, auto exposure test. That being said, I'll see you next time.